More thunderstorms in southwest Florida today, but this time yesterday, streets around Fort Myers were flooded under heavy downpours. And just across the river in North Fort Myers, wind caused significant damage to some homes. White News reporter Michelle Alvarez shows us the damage. This roof ripped apart. The metal lifted up and bent back by the strong wind. This roof ripped off in places. Look closely and you see the temporary tarp. The storm seemed to target Mobile Manor in North Fort Myers Tuesday afternoon. The storm started coming up and the wind started going really fast and you heard a lot of um, banging and things falling. Jeannie Ryan was inside her home when the rain started falling and the wind started whipping around. So was Charles Housel. Yes, it was just boom. I mean, the wind just was horrendous there for just a few seconds. Housel lost part of his roof and his awning is gone. Still, he's grateful because what's damaged can be replaced. That something can be fixed. Nobody was hurt, so I'm good with it. I mean, Mother Nature at her worst. Donald Morrison has lived in Mobile Manor since 2001. I've been through Charlie, Wilma, and Irma. He says the damage this time isn't as bad as when Charlie hit. Some downed fences and tress and shrubs. But unlike those hurricanes, this storm caught him by surprise. When it came through, it was like, it, felt, it sounded like a tornado is what it really sounded like. I mean, it was just really fast, quick. The storm impacted some homes more than others, forcing people to pick up and fix up their yards. It knocked some stuff off in the back, but uh, it was all, you know, able to pick it up. So other than the, this here and... I had water coming through it, knocked one of my cables, or covers off up top. I fixed it already. But everyone here agrees. They'd like a break from the wind and rain, so they don't have to make any more repairs. Michelle Alvarez, Wink News, now.